Hey YouTube, got another video review for you today. This one's from a company by the name of Anchor Hog. And this, this product here is for people who are trying to keep their stuff secure. You know, whether it be, you know, your kayaks, your grill, or, you know, your patio furniture, trailers, ladders, boats, bikes, motorcycles, generators, just anything that's of value that you want to, you know, uh, protect and, and keep a thief from just walking away with your stuff. And what this product is, is basically just a, a, an anchor point. And whenever you uh, get the box, it'll have uh, the packaging just like this. They'll throw in a keychain, and then when you open the box up, you'll notice the device. And what this is, is basically uh, it's got a base plate and a top plate and they're interlocking and the way that it works is there's a little bolt that's right in here and this pretty much doesn't really do a whole lot it just holds the two plates together but the way that it works once you take that bolt out is you just take and unhook it and you're going to take and secure this down to whatever surface that you want uh, to secure your items to. Whether it be, let's say, a concrete floor out in a driveway or on a, a, a patio, uh, like on a, at a condo or something. Let's say you've got some furniture and a grill out there and you don't want somebody just to walk up and steal your stuff. And so what you want to do is, is just secure this down uh, with some screws to, like I said, you know, you can secure it down to uh, concrete. You could secure it to a wood surface. Let's say you wanted to mount this on the side of your house. And, you know, let's say you've got siding on the side. You could definitely do that. Uh, you just want to, to mount it. Then you take this little interlocking piece, and I'm sorry for such bad camera work. You can see that little slot right in there. But you just take the interlocking piece and you slide it right into that slot and once you slide it in then you take your little bolt and then you tighten it up and keep in mind this bottom piece will be secured and then now you can take and run you a padlock through here and into whatever whatever you're trying to secure so i'm gonna i'm gonna show you how to how to do it let's say you're mounting it to the side of a house or to the side of a post I'm going to show you exactly what I'm talking about. We're going to use this board as, as our mounting surface. And let's say we're just going to mount it right in here. What you want to do is leave this piece off to the side. When you buy the anchor hog, it comes with four mounting screws. But since I'm just doing this for demonstration purposes, I'm just going to use some wood screws to mount it down to this piece of wood. And uh, you can use a drill or an impact, just whichever. Let's get it straight. Okay, now that I've got it mounted, you can see that this plate is not going anywhere. And to be able to, for a thief to get a pry bar up underneath there, it's gonna be really difficult for them to pry that up. One, because that's pretty thick steel right in there. You're not gonna just be able to just pry it up like it's butter or anything. And you know, me, if I was mounting it into wood, I might even put a, a screw there in the middle so there would be no chance that they could even get anything in there. But let's just say they put a screwdriver or something in there. You're going to bend this screwdriver before you bend that steel right there. I guarantee you. And let's say they put a, a pry bar, was able to chisel the wood out a little bit with a pry bar. I, it, it would take them literally some time to get uh, in there to those screws. But... The thing is, they can't, they can't really get in there to pry it up because this piece right here slides into that little groove right there and it protects the side where you would really have to dig in there to be able to pry that up. And so, you know, I've got a pry bar here and it'd be, it'd be really hard to, to get something up underneath there and get enough leverage on it to pry that off. Now I'm not saying it couldn't be done because yeah, 
there's a way to get into everything. Yeah, you, you really could. I mean, you could take a sledgehammer and a pry bar and get into it. But I'll go ahead and tell you, somebody's going to hear you or see you long before you'll be able to pry this thing off of any surface. Guaranteed. Because it's going to take some doing to get that off of there. Let's say you've got a generator. Let's say this is mounted into concrete. And you're, you're wanting to... Uh, mount a generator let's say it's snowing outside and your electricity went out and you know you want to run your generator but you don't want it, somebody just to be able to steal it so what you would do is you take a, a, a cable just like this and you can buy these at Walmart I got this from from Anchor Hog they sell them on their website you can take and run this cable through the the generator through like the uh, the frame of the generator and then take loop it back through and take your padlock and they sell these these are commercial quality uh, master locks you can get those on the anchor hog website as well and once you you get this cable right in here wrapped around your generator then you just lock this in place and now you know there's there's no way for them to really to get it. Now, I say that to say this. They can get anything that they want. Somebody comes through here with a set of torches. Yeah, they can get it off. If they come through here with a set of bolt cutters. Yeah, they can cu always cut the lock. But that's not the point. The, the point is, is this is just a deterrent to slow somebody down. You know, keep them from just walking up and just grabbing your stuff. They're gonna have to have some sort of tools to get this off. You're not just gonna be able to walk up and yank this and it just come right off or hit it with a hammer and get it to come off because you're not. You're not gonna be able to get it off that simple. Now, if you're wondering how many locks you can fit in, there's three holes right in here. So you could put three different padlocks in there for, for different stuff. Now, if you if you run out of, of uh, places to secure, let's say you need uh, four just take in a run the uh, cable through the uh, padlock twice so you could you could possibly hook more than just three things in there if you wanted to because these uh, these cables will fit in there you can fit another one another cable in there if you let's just say you had you know four or five six six items you could easily put six six cables in there so don't let the three holes fool you you can only get three padlocks in there but you could, you could get multiple cables in there. So anyways, now this Anchor Hog, it comes in um, several different colors. So it comes in black, red, yellow, zinc plated, and stainless steel. Now it ranges in price. Uh, this one here is your stainless steel one, so it's going to be uh, more expensive just because, you know, it's it's made out of stainless and the materials are a little bit more money. So this one's $42.95 on their website. The zinc plated, you can pick it up for like $29.95. So $30, that's not bad. But, you know, if you're going to be around salt water or places where, you know, there's going to be, a, you know, a, a lot of moisture, I would definitely consider getting the... Uh, stainless steel one because it's going to provide the the most corrosion protection now let's say uh, you don't want to use one of these braided steel cables you don't have to use these uh, it's made also where you can just use a chain you know you could wrap a chain around your stuff and then secure it with uh, the padlock now i will say you know the advantage of using uh, a braided cable is you know whatever it rubs up against it's not going to you know hurt the finish so anyways i appreciate you guys watching uh please like and subscribe to the uh channel and make sure you smash the uh notification bell and that way you, it'll keep bringing it back to my channel every time i i uh, upload a new video and you know, if there's something that you'd like to see me do a review on, please put it in the comments. I will uh, take a look at it and see if I can get one and do a review on it. But uh, anyways, I give the uh, two, two thumbs up for uh, Anchor Hog. I think it's a pretty cool product. Anyways, thanks for watching.